Hey there everybody, Fett here, and welcome back to Fett Plays RimWorld 1.0, aka Dirk Dwipple Butchers All the Things 1.0. That's pretty good. I don't, I don't even know what he's grab- well, I think he's grabbing the Galatross. Oh, that is gonna be so much stuff. We're gonna get so much, well, stuff out of it. I mean, we're already up to freaking 4,912 thrombo meat, 3,000 lockjaw meat, and hundreds of caviar. What's not to like? Even I'm eating it. I'm like, yum. Fish ovulation. How good. It's not actually ovulation. It's just the eggs. It's the ovum if you want to be all technical about it. But please don't do that in my house. It's, it, this is a Christian broadcast of RimWorld. Anyway, I like this. I like this a lot. We brought the boys back home after doing a few more conquerors here. Shadow Stream is up to the top left. They might be next on our chopping block, depending on how frisky we're feeling. We'll just have to see. Peterson the Taxonomist is no longer inspired, but we have freaking 4,360 Galatross meat. So don't worry, we're doing fine. I'm surprised you only got one horn. What, well, you couldn't pull one out of its ass? Oh my god, we have three thrombo horns. That's amazing. I have no idea what possesses them to put those in different locations. But anyway, tell you what. We have plenty of meat. Let's stop dehydrating fruit for a while. We need to make more substantial stuff. Some meat-based meals, if you will. I don't think we have any salt either. Yeah, we're. I'm pretty sure we're saltless. So, yeah, it's really start making that meat. Get us some lavish... Dude, what is his skill in lit cooking? Tan? Truly, he can make bulk meals, right? Let's see. Four lavish meals requires 12 cooking. What about fine meals? He can do four fines, but we have... We have no... Yeah, we don't have any fine meals. But dude, dude, dude. Give me 400 fine meals. Do this for me, if you will be so kind. We also make cloud cocoa. It's a cocoa-flavored cod cotton candy? Ah, that's interesting. Anyway. Yeah, make... We have no one who can cook eight pots of stew. What about someone who can cook four stir-frieds? Yo, he can make stir-fried meals. Hit us up with this deliciousness. My good friend and ally. What about four stews? No, we don't have an order for four stews. Alright, fine. Be that way. We could make bulk pemmican. I mean, it's not that great. I mean, it's a good travel meal, but I mean, we have 559 words. Survival meals. I don't think we need more. Instead, we could just slap down a bunch of fine meals. Have ourselves a fine time. Everyone's gonna be doing fine. I'm pretty sure, yeah, he's out of those now, so he has other things to do with his life. And it looks like we have a couple of extra limestone blocks, so we're gonna get a little bit more progress here. Nuclear power's coming, boys. You just have to ask yourself, are you ready for it? The answer may surprise you. Although it probably shouldn't, because I'm asking you, and if you don't know what the answer is, then I think we're a little lost. It's not going to be coming from Dirk, though, because he's got to make some advanced components. Because we have the material to make hundreds of them. And yet, for some reason, our lazy asses were okay with having, like, 40. We could be literally just shipping these over to Ragamuffin whenever they need them. And getting Dirk Dwipple's crafting seal up. Like, what are we doing with our lives over here, you know? Shadow, I was going to say, Shadow, are you stuck? Are you actually stuck? We got a hauler bot to make, dude. Are you working on it? You are engineering robotics. You're also incredibly hungry. So I'm not sure. What are you doing at this time? Please don't tell me you're making robotic components instead. He is making robotic components instead. 
You actual, factual man. I want hauler bots. Let's get rid of some of these that were not. Yeah, I guess we could should have kept those at the top. But anyway. There you go. Here comes the plasteel. You put the plasteel around the bot, you see. Now he's got to go grab the matrix. There it is. The secrets to all of our desires. He's picked it up. He's ravenously hungry, but the dude is working. He's making robots happen. All right. I'm going to let him go eat. <laughs> go get some food. At least now we have the order down. And we know he's the one to do it. And that makes me feel a little happier. Rainbow Flommel can get out of this house. As can most of the other animals here. We're going to have a lot of food around here as well. And by a lot of food, I mean we already have like 23,000 meats. Don't worry about it. Alright, I hear some butchering over here too. Butchers, or rivers, doing up a fish. Frank got some freaking cloth while fishing. And eventually Koshigiri and or Lyra may be part of our team as well. Could be good. Could be bad, who even knows? Now we're doing back over here. Alright, still rocking together. More advanced components, I appreciate that. Like we got a bit more done over here. It's good. Let's go ahead and slap down some heavy boardwalk over here. Actually, no, we could do limestone heavy boardwalk. Just do this up the right way. There we go. And then we just put the put the limes the bricks under it to seal it all up and then we'll be good well that'll be pretty great isn't that right credmo he knows because he's putting down some limestone right now he's like my dude it'll be so good you won't even believe it why are you cutting the palm tree you're cutting this palm tree in particular okay i mean if you're gonna do that we might as well have an order to cut all plants in here. Since we're going to be doing that anyway. An easy task for one Dirk the Dwipple. 164 wood. Holy cow. Easiest 800 wood we've ever gathered. Big dogs is going to Pave right over this tree. Don't worry about it. It's fine, I guess. This mighty teak. 93% grown. It'll be a valuable source of wood. Don't worry. And some berries. Not necessary, but not complaining. You know what I mean? Picking up what I'm putting down. Singing the song of my people over here. 152 wood. Beautiful. Absolute beauty. What's your plan now? Hauling limestone, huh? I see how it is. Can we get some more actual work done? Good stuff. This is a living centipede. We could probably fix that if we really wanted to. 95% done with this feralisk already. Holy cow, they grow so fast. It's actually a little insane. Hello, elephant. How you doing? You're not my enemy. Not yet. That could change at any time, though. Please don't get it twisted. All right, hydraulics in the house. I thought you were... I thought you were moving limestone blocks. What are you doing? All right. I mean, I get it. I put in the order. He's fulfilling the order. And it's nice to have a bunch of extra 
advanced components lying around. I mean, we're already out of them over here again. That took, like, no time at all. Yeah, tell you what. New plan. Don't make advanced components over here. Yeah, we can cancel this, baby. Yeah. Don't worry about it. All right. Well, that's probably why. We're making spacer components, which do require advanced components. In fact, to make 108 of them, we would require literally 108 advanced components. But we do have nine architect power cells. We're actually really close to having an architect battery. Ooh, baby. In fact, I think once we get 10 of those and the eight specific components again... We should sling those over to Fort Django and just replace the current... Well, we don't really have a battery system, no. We just had the PPC, don't we? I guess we'll use it... Now we can use it over here. I mean, a rogue AI prevents zits. What's not to love? Elephant revenge. That's not lovely. Gulpy's right in the middle of it. So, Augusto, you really need to stop hunting, my dude. You're putting yourself into a bunch of danger. And you're already, like, half dead. Bulpy, why are you on a run order? You could be on attack. You are not a terrible fighter. Okay, maybe you're a little terrible. There you go. Problem solved. Yeah, please put out our... Uh, Hey, thank you. Our ground runner here. And maybe she's a little bit of a bad shot, but still. You know, she didn't need to be running away. I'm just saying. Let me put order for that under here. And that'll cover all that up. I mean, you're basically using double the limestone to make it look a little bit better. But it, in my opinion, it does make it a little bit better. All right. Ooh, it's got even. It's done. Extracting from clone vat. Nah, give give it a minute. This one's not done yet. Gotta have them both done. If you don't do it together, you might as well not do it at all. Someone said that he was probably a fool. All right. He's coming. Opponent situation. Is it coming? We're at 120. It's going to stink to have to send 100 of them over to Ragamuffin, and then Dirk's just going to start doing that all over again. Well, that's all right. It is necessary. Also, we need marshy soil on... How much of this? I think all of this needs marshy soil. Well, this spot obviously doesn't, but this does. There you go. Cool. Does it just mean or is it some of it different color than others? This is a different color than this, right? Or am I going insane? Maybe it's not. Maybe maybe my eyes are playing tricks on me. Oh lord. It's the 31 year old ocular curse. Help me! Oh my god. Oh Vulpy, you could you can on draft now, by the way. Ah! Just looked over here and it was a, a freaking bazillion animals. Why are you... Okay, why in the blue hell are you doing blocks when you could be doing freaking... It's your fault, isn't it, Tinker? You son of a diddly. Well, you know what? It's pretty quick to make these robotic components. Might as well let them finish. And then Shadow can get another bot done for us. We can do a formal trade between Ragamuffin City and Fort Django. Well, land of the Fet. We are still waiting on some trades, I believe, as well. I think all in Ragamuffin, in fact. Hello, little Fairless. How you all doing? Hope you're all having a good time. Dismiss, making sure our... Limestone block collection doesn't fall down to nothing. I appreciate the support. I really do. Okay, 
Can I say I just like watching him work on these so effectively and quickly? I mean, he has made himself a strong expert already. And we're at 150. Just 100 more to go. It's so awesome. As is the fact that we have, uh, you know, so much material for it. Did I hear a... I thought I heard one of those fairless trying to hunt. Maybe it was it just it being woken up. 98%. Couple more hours to go, probably. Alright, Dirk, what are you doing? Oh, you're gonna help with this? Awesome! It's actually amazing to see you doing something, literally anything else with your life right now. Boop, boop, boop. And now he's gonna eat and give himself an eight without table debuff. But he got some more work done. So, you know, hallelujah for that. Major break risk on Augusto. Well, I mean, you are in intense pain. You're also hungry. You lost a couple of grandparents. And you had some disturbed sleep. Why don't you go? D don't you dare eat without a table. Don't, don't you dare. You get your ass inside this base and you eat with a table. Gosh dang it. Mm-mm. Uh-uh-uh-uh. We have an extremely impressive dining room. I don't know if you knew this, but we do. You don't have to use that specific dining room. I don't care if you go eat in the prison. But you're going to eat in a room. You actual factual fool. Ah, Wheatley's doing some more hunting. Oh, good for him. I'll come back to check on you. Still at 150. Oh, he must have just gotten back. I understand now. All right. Couple. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're doing it. All right, just this spot, cover it up with the limestone. We'll practically be done with it. You can see how it's sealed up right here. It looks good. At the very least, it looks okay. I mean, come on, Augusto. You don't want to eat without table, do you? Why would you want that? No, that'd be something that would be like an accident. You know? What are we doing with... 26 duck egg. Uh, someone gave that to us, I'm pretty sure. Mythic is named guinea pig number three. Tango! Check out Tango here. Looking like a little boss. Hanging out with Mystic. It's lovely. Honestly, what more could you ask for? Alright. Back to Fort Django. Are people still... Oh, it's nighttime, so most of the humans, lazy bastards that we are, are sleeping. Learn to max today. Further learning multiplied by 20%, which means it's lowered by 20%, I believe that means. So he's going to be learning a lot slower until the next day. Which is unfortunate. Oh. What up? Fairless Revenge. What were you little jerks trying to hunt? Dirk's like, nope, no. Nope. Don't have to pull up with this crap. Get out of my house. All y'alls. We're done. Easy rares. Okay. This one done? It is done. All right. Let him out. Dirk. Unleash the beast. Here they come. Here they come. Oh, she's a beauty. And we even get our stuff back. I love it. In fact, teach him how to rescue as well. Maybe they can rescue by shot and web. It's amazing. 
They're both one year and 12 days old somehow, but they're still amazing. Our whole body is a clone. They don't care, though. They're animals. Why would they give a... Alright, so more... More clones, right? And we just keep making Feralisk. That's how you do it. Can anyone complain? Does anyone have a complaint about this? I'm willing to listen to complaints right now, but not really. Oh, crap. We were ambushed by manhunting roosters! Oh, no! It's a bunch of dangerous kicks! All right. All right, guys. Watch out. Hold up over here. There's nothing to laugh at. Good job. Good job, guys. We almost died. All right. Keep going. Where are you guys? Freaking town are you guys? Oh yeah, you were heading towards Ragamuffin. That's right, you guys were heading back home. Yeah, we don't need to pick up the dead rooster, I don't think. Just keep going. We'll be home in 2.5 days. Now it's slightly terrifying. You know, except for the part where it wasn't at all. More meadow abs. Can't complain too much. So, these guys, 36 is the most, 29 is the least. All right, they're going, they're going. They're almost ready to be let out. Got some light repairs to carry out on this obelisk. Don't mind Dirk, though. He's got to relax socially, though. Not in any other capacity. All right, go eat. Consuming bowl of stew. There you go. Yeah, go relax in here. It's unbelievably impressive. It'll be a nice place. You watch before he gets there and actually eats. He's going to go nuts. Alright, we're at our robotic component limit, so... Tomorrow, Shadow can get to work on the robot, hopefully. You know, if he can make time to do it. The synthetic heart needs to be refrigerated. Okay, we can put the synthetic heart in, just not the the other. I don't understand why, but I don't care either. That's all right. Next day, someone can make this happen. What's the percentage on that? Oh, I need to take out Hotaru, please. Ninety percent. Hmm. And Nene's surgery success chance. 113. She should be good enough. Do you have a better surgery success chance, Vasilla? 116. Yeah, a little bit better. Hmm. She's an artiste of the body. There he goes. Getting his nummins in. Mmm, -mm, delicious food. How much I love my stew. I hope I don't get an infection in one of these burns and end up with a case of the dead. That would make me sad. This stew will help me because it fortifies my antibodies. Delicious. There we go. That'll up his mood. Beautiful. Actually beautiful. How long are you going to relax socially? Hydraulic already getting on the case of training these spiders. Dude. A spider, mechanoid, and clone army. What else could you ask for? In this day and age, isn't that what all true dictators want? Let's be real. If you don't want a spider army, what are you even doing with your life? Alright, limestone block moving time. So says Dirk. How are we doing on advanced components now? 170. Pretty nice. Tell you what, we'll do a trade when everyone has all the stuff worth trading. No, wait, we can't do it like that. When the robot's ready in Ragamuffin, we'll do the trade. Robot for advanced components. 
that's how we do. All right, and then we'll get all the stuff for the battery ready to send from Ragamuffin to Poor Django, and then we'll do another trade. It'll be, uh, I gotta put this down here now. It'll be batter, architect battery stuff for more advanced components, because honestly, that's all we really need to make over here are advanced components. Good job on the repairs. Now he's got to do the bat stuff. Don't worry about it, though. Hey, we need to fill up these vats down. Oh, wait. This one's idle? No, no, no. Put a feralisk skin here. What are you doing? Don't move those back in there. No, we're making stuff here. We're doing science over here, okay? Don't screw it up for us. Please. Really not much to worry about over here in Microton. I mean, everything's going pretty well. We even got a variety. We have dates up the wazoo. We have watermelon. We have figs. We have lentils. And when it comes to veggies, 25,000. Yeah, we're pretty stacked. A lot of fruits as well. I mean, honestly, if you're eating food somewhere on planet, what the hell is this planet's name again? If you're eating food somewhere on FWK20, you're probably eating it from Microton. You're getting something from Microton, probably. It just makes sense, you know what I mean? 180, we're almost there. How's the goose still doing? Laying down, taking a sleep. Doing pretty good. His mood is going to boost way back up when he's done. It's an extremely impressive hospital. It makes him feel better already. He's got some ambient music being played in here. It calms him down. It's a big room. It's pretty. You know? It has a psychic emanator around it. it makes him feel strange, but relaxed. What's not the love? Hataru. Probably feeling good for the same reasons. I mean, look at her! She's got extremely low expectations. She's hungry. When did your son Don die? I... Ooh. Bulby, you okay? Did you know you lost your brother? Oh, you also lost your uncle. And your grandparent. And your aunt. But I mean, you seem to be doing alright because... All four of these are minus 19 and you're getting a plus 15 from the, all your animals. So I guess between that and living in a decent bedroom, you're doing just fine. Hey, what can I say? People are weird. 190. Here comes number 200, dudes. And he's learning at a regular rate again. It's actually beautiful. We're up to 131 meals already. We only got 1.5 days to preserve this Galatross meat, boys, so we better get to doing. In fact, Big Dog, once you're done eating here, could you maybe merge these berries? into a single berry patch, and then we can maybe get the Galatross meat in here. You picking up what I'm putting down? I know you are. You're a smart lad. Alright, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. That was a really weak attempt. Tell you what, I got a better idea. Pick up this shroom soup. This is yours now. You can eat it. Congrats. Now, Dirk. Uh, merge the Galatross meat? Is this higher priority? Important? Low. Yes, it is. So it should be getting moved. Okay. Let's try something else. Um, are you serious? I can't put a urgent haul order on this? Found no items that require hauling. I don't know if I appreciate this. Hmm. This is a slight issue. Why is that? 
raw food, meats. No fish meat, no flammel meat. Okay, I get that kind of. Gallistross meat is allowed in here, though. So why is it not in here? Also, let's go ahead and open this up to fine meals. Maybe we can get these moved over here. Make more room for our Galatross. I mean, we're at 200 components now. I guess that's all right. And it looks like we're doing mostly okay. That is going to be it for this episode. If that plays RimWorld 1.0, if you enjoyed it, make sure to let me know by giving a like. If you haven't already, feel free to subscribe for more. This is going to keep coming and won't stop coming. Until then, we're not buying anything from these guys because they got a couple of... I mean, a Builder 5 is pretty sweet. But we're not selling anything for it. And they don't have any fractal enhancements, which is basically all I would want. Get out of here with your dark young sap. Thank you again for watching this episode of That Plays Rim World 1.0. My name is Thet, and I will see you in the next video. A little nice spidey whitey. So cute.